Sometimes work. Oi. It's working now. Do 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 do. Aha! Uh -huh. I have noise. I have noise on the stream. Huzzah! Um, do 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 do. Uh, let me see if this works. See if if you can hear the fucking game. That would be really fantastic. I think you can. I think you can. And that's what's pretty great. Yeah, you can hear me now. Everything is going a lot better. So let me tell you exactly what happened. You see, my fucking computer, it got the coronavirus, you see. I don't know how, considering that it was like an actual virus for humans and shit, but somehow it got digitized because for the last two fucking streams when I was trying to get this thing to work the audio would just go completely bonkers and fucking Razor Snimps would be fucking everything up making every the whole fucking screen all black and shit now I don't like it when my screen goes completely black okay because I can't see anything and I don't know what it do so that right there immediately pisses me off off the bat. So I'm over here trying to figure everything out. I can't figure anything out. And so I had to fucking completely destroy every goddamn file on my goddamn system and reinstall everything I've had previously because I'm an idiot and didn't fucking put a backup on them. So, I'm going through fucking manually installing my drivers because this fucking, these apps that I have, I have to pay money for me to actually make it go faster. So, I, I just don't have any money. So, I was going through in a slow fucking pace trying to get all these drivers all set up and shit so that I can start listening to all my fucking music properly and fixing up Spotify and all this shit. Because Spotify, that's another thing. Spotify was fucking just skipping every single song, and I don't understand why. So, I had to fucking reinstall every driver I had. I, it was just ridiculous. I, I fucking did so much to fix this shit. And finally, I think I fixed it. So that's fucking great. And I'm glad you can hear me now. I, I believe you can hear me now, because I fucking heard myself, because... Uh, if you say you don't hear me, I'm gonna call you a fucking liar. But that's what happened. That's the entirety of what happened in this stream. I'm fucking tired as hell. I just want to sleep at this point. But this stream is just a fucking for now. Uh, this stream is uh, put that on hell yeah. Oh no, maybe. There we go. I might. It, if I get a bit too into it, then I'll keep on playing. But this stream, for the most part, is just for a, uh, it's just for me to make sure that everything is is going on right, it's working proper. Yes. All right. With that being said, let's just continue on with the game. Yeah. Act like nothing happened. All right. I completed this cave. I am a fucking beast. And you stood no chance because you can't stand. You're just floating there. You don't know how to stand, do you? That's right. That's right. I beat you up so much that you forgot how to stand. Let me just get around this. Oh, what the hell happened here? What in the... Why? Why is my menu like this? It's just ridiculous. Look at this shit. Uh, yes. Right there. Right here. Maybe a little bit to the left. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Hold on. What are you doing right here? You're not supposed to be right here. Get out of here, you dummy. 
Ooh. All right. Hell yeah. Get everything working now. Can finally play the game. That's the best part right there, but being able to fucking play the game. Without any interruptions. Alright. Got all that set up. We need to check out all the options and make sure that everything is in tip top shape. Yes, 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 of course, yes. Maximum settings. Uh, yes. Uh, everything is here. Everything seems to be in tip top shape, I do believe. Alright. Heck yeah, man. Let's fucking go, mate. It's fucking working now. Woo! Woo! What do I have? No, I need that. Um, just me. Yeah. Huh. Oi! I found you! No! 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 Go, 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 go! Ah! Frick. I don't want to have to go through all that again. Fuck that. Oi, fuck you, mate. Why can't I hit you? It doesn't work. What the hell? Come on, I can't. Just land the hit. One hit, please. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Fucking smashing you out. Uh, where's my healing sh shit? There it is. Take that in there. Yeah, heal me. Let me take your fucking... Your god... Uh, I ran out of charge. Ah, fuck. Fuck, mate. You, you fucking bloody wanker. I hope you know that. Fucking die, mate. Die. Yeah, that's what I'd like to see. Ooh. I got a new weapon, yeah, yeah. Fuck you, mate. Taking all your shit. Hell yeah. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to fucking see. Put that shit right here. And save the game just in case some bullshit happens. Definitely keeping all this shit. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go, mate. Bloody fantastic. Oh, yeah. It's what I like. It's what I like. Oh yeah, this noise. All right, where am I going? Where the hell am I? Ah oh, yes, I'm, make, I'm getting flowers. That's what I was doing. That's what I was doing. Before everything was completely fucked over. I got willow anther. I don't know if I need that. Willow anther. Yes, I do. I think I just need stone flower. Heather gold. Willow gold. Uh, heather. Willow gold. Heather. In stone petals. Yep. Just need stone petals. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go and get some fucking stone petals, mate. That's what, I, that's what I'm going to do. Let's fucking go, dude. Let's get all this shit going. What are you? That's a golden can it. That's a heather. How about I hold it now? Let's see. Ah. Where the hell are some fucking stone petals? What do you find stone petals at? What the hell does a stone petal even look like? Does it look like a fucking stone? Oi! Come here, you little rat. I'm gonna fucking chop you up. Chop you up, right. Get you nice chopping. Chopping! Chopping time! That's right. 
That's right. That's right. Eat it. Eat it. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I like to say. Quit fucking dirtying up my streets with your body. Your disgusting, ugly body. You fucking rat fangs. Like you a fucking rat vampire. Even though fucking rats have teeth on the fucking middle. That's why their two longest teeth are. I don't know why the fuck you have fucking vampire teeth. Crazy ass rat. It's your nonsense. Fucking die, you disgusting worm. I hate you. You always annoy me when I try to go to sleep around you. You're just like, hey, you're sleeping. Well, uh, well, not anymore. Fuck you, mate. I'm just, just gonna go run up on you and fucking disturb your sleep because fuck you, mate. I'm just like, well, fuck you. I'm gonna fucking kill you for being an asshole, you fucking dick. Don't like anything that you're doing out here. The fuck is a stone flower at? Stoneflower? They don't look like a stoneflower. I think that's a real air. Oi! Bad dog! I don't like you. You're a fucking bad dog. A menace to society. Nope. 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 I don't think so. Nope. 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 Let's see. Yep, that's a willow. This is a black anther. Completely different from Black Panther. Imagine it was the fucking SJW version of Black Panther. It'd be Black Panther, fucking flower, fucking pansy just running around, fucking changing his sex, thinking that he's a fucking jellyfish. <laughs> Oi! Just don't say Heather. I don't need that. I don't need anything right here. What about it over there? What is that? Is that a stone flower? Are you stone flowers? It is a stone flower. Ah, shit. It didn't have anything. <gasps> yes. Yes, that's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. And also, I need to fucking sleep. <laughs> oh, boy. Hey. All right, let's see. I'm gonna get back to Balmora. It's over there. All right. I'm gonna go inside. I'm gonna have a nap, and then I'm gonna fucking leave. I'm gonna get the hell out of here and complete my mission, because I'm done. I'm done, mate. I don't. I did it. I found all the flowers. I'm a fucking pansy. I'm a fairy. I picked all the fucking flowers in the goddamn woods. A mushroom forest. It sounds pretty mythical, right? Mushroom forest. That's the right term for this place, I'm pretty sure. Mushroom forest. It's a marsh, but it's got a bunch of mushrooms like a fucking forest. All right. All right. Hey, you're stuck in there real good, mate. Okay. There we go. On to adventure. <laughs> and head back. Yeah, Belmora was over here, so I'm gonna let. I'm so glad things are working proper now. So happy. My audio sounds more beautiful than ever. Uh, for me at least, because I, I updated all my fucking audio drivers and I'm using my own personal audio setup so that I can hear things quite lovely. Uh, I think the quality for you should be pretty damn good too uh, because I got a pretty damn good mic uh, for uh, one that I'm going to be upgrading once I get enough money 
It's the HyperX Quadcaster. It's pretty great. Don't know if you can hear me or anything. I forget. Uh, wait, something's going on. Hold on. Uh, Rich, real quick. Just a mic check. Alright, yeah, you can hear me. Hello, welcome to the stream. I got my fucking shit all working proper now. Oh, what's that? It's a fucking... Oh. I know what that is. That's a Dwemer Ruin. That place is dangerous, actually. I don't think I want to go there. Hey! Fuck you, mate. I don't... I don't like you. Nobody likes you. You're all annoying. Just wait when I become a fucking god. Completely destroy you and your fucking families. Oi! Stupid worm. Come here. I'm gonna fucking chop you up. Turn you into sashimi. Delicious. Finally. Some good fucking food. Smack a whack, little bitch. I don't I didn't I don't know what I didn't know what to rhyme with whack. Snack. Oh, he's fucking Kogodi. Fuck you. Fucking blocking my way. I want to avoid it. I don't want to fight it. It's a fucking dinosaur. Do you see that thing? Oi. Keep on going. Keep going, mate. Alright. Oi. As long as oh, he's attacking me. He's he's coming right for me. Oh shit! Oh look at that fucking beast right here. He's like a fucking. He's like a beetle. <laughs> like a beetle, fucking rhino beetle, just just charging at me. I don't know what the fuck his intentions are, but he's coming right for me. What did I put this on? Fucking smack the shit out of you, you little fuck. Oi, fuck you. Oi, 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 oi. Oi, 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 Fuck off. Fuck you. I fucking stabbed the shit out Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, I was so close. I was so close. Damn it. I was right there. Oh, fuck. I got a fucking rest until he up now and that's great <laughs> die by a fucking dinosaur see that's why you don't go fight fucking dinosaurs because they fucking eat you alive dinosaurs are dangerous man <laughs> uh, okay back on the fucking road Hopefully I don't see that fucking dinosaur again. That would, re that would really suck. Because it's a fucking dinosaur. I mean, eventually I'll fucking be able to beat it. But I mean... I'm not ready to fucking fight a dinosaur yet. <laughs> I probably could have beat it, actually. Maybe if I put on my hammer. Fucking smack the damn thing around quite a bit. Shadow would have hit it. Oi! Fucking worm! Get out of here! I'm gonna smack you up. Turn you into sushi rolls. Individual fucking snacks. You bitch. Oi! Fuck you! And no, stop spitting on me, you dirty little wanker. I don't want any of your fucking spit all over me. Fuck you. Oi! Fucking dumb drivers. Don't know what the fuck they're doing. Gonna fucking kill someone. What? What? Why the hell was there fight music? I was just scared for my life right there. <laughs> I just felt the presence of a fucking dead dinosaur, just the essence of the dinosaur's rage. I shouldn't be here, actually. Uh, I should go over here. Yes. Right? 
Yeah, yeah. This is where I should go. It's. Oh wait, maybe it's the fucking Fort Moonmouth, because the guards hate me there, even though I don't have a bounty on me. They just really don't like me. I don't know why. I'm a pretty charming person. I mean, look at that. Look at my personality. It's fucking 102. I'm fucking awesome. I don't know why they would hate me. Bastards. Oi! He's coming after me. You see that shit? He's fucking charging right for me. He's fucking crazy, mate. This dude's fucking crazy. Look at him. Look at him, he's just going where I fucking was, like a fucking weirdo. He's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you, mate, show you that I'm the fucking alpha beast. I'm gonna fucking go exactly where you were running and still catch up to you. Fucking absolute unit, mate. Crazy bastard. Dude's a fucking madman. Alright, here we go. Yep, just gotta get over this hill. Yeah, oh, that, that hurt. That hurt quite a bit. Ouch. Ouchie, ouchies. I should save because I don't want to have to walk all the way over here. Every time you enter a town, every time you go and complete a mission, or if you kill someone, fucking save. Because <laughs> your health is not going to be that fantastic. Not unless you fucking beef yourself out with some uh, with some sweet exploits. Oi, what's in here? Nothing. 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 Oi! Wait a minute. Okay, yeah, it's the same shit. Ugh. I thought I fucking misclicked, but no. Both of those crates, they have the same shit. Oh, so does that one. Sometimes you can find a pretty sweet weapon. It's just one gold, I don't need it. Oh, I will. Oh, I fucking will. I'll take all the shit. Oi! What's this? I don't, I don't need that. Oi! Uh, advancement. Okay. I don't need to do that right now. Excuse me, ma'am, but you're not going to get one. You, you were in my way. You're blocking the entrance. It's not nice. Does Jack the Ripper have flowers for a giraffe? Indeed I do. You see, they, here they are. Yes, these are the flowers that the giraffe needs. Ajira has made more potions for you. Ajira hopes that you will use them well. Ajira has been updated. Removed, 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 removed. Cheap restore magicka potions. Well, okay, why? Ajira is very sorry. Ajira has much work to do on these reports, so Ajira can win her bet with Galbadir. Galbadir. Maybe you could fetch a, a new ceramic bowl for Ajira? What? <laughs> really? <laughs> yes, take these ten drakes and go find Ajira a ceramic bowl. Ajira thinks Vravir, the trader here in Balmora, has some. Okay. I think I've heard him speak of some ceramic bowls. Something about the brown ones last longer, but the blue ones are pretty as fuck. They're fucking gorgeous! Verbatim, that's what he said. How he said it. Uh, is this a trader? I think you're the trader. Better. Hello. <laughs> Ceramic bowl? Yes. And, uh, redware bowl, ceramic bowl. One ceramic bowl. Offer. Yes. No, I'm not here for the Daedric weapons, my dude. I just wanted the bowl. Thank you.
All right. Let's get this mission complete. You're still in the fucking way? No. Move. Fucking needy bitch. Hello. What? Ashira must find her stone and report. Ashira needs your help very badly. I already restore Algira's reports on the properties of local mushrooms and flowers. Ashira knows Galbadir did not leave the Mages Guild. So the reports must be nearby. Uh, okay. Uh, nothing. Hmm. I don't see it under the bed. What? Secrets, natural properties. Do, 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 do. Gold candidate has yellow flowers and very dark green leaves with a very sh with sharp spines. Gold can have strong flowers and da, 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 da. paste that restores strength. Oh. Or later on. Oh, no, 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 no. But they last only a short time. Extremely so that always crush emeralds and water. What? Gain more magical for a short time by mixing stone flower petals with crushed emeralds and water? Uh, willow cure common disease. Uh, paralyzation for cork bulb. Wow. As yet, I think Heather comes from Skyrim because the leaves look like the spiny leaves of trees in Skyrim. <laughs> the flowers are also pink like the Nord people. <laughs> when mixed with ruby, it makes very good potion to make you not waste so much. Oh. Whoa, it's kind of cool. Neat. So here's one of them. Uh, thank you. What? <laughs> the hell are you talking about, lady? You're crazy. No, just looking for something. Galbadir, I'm gonna need you to move, please. Galbadir, I know you're hiding something. Yep, you did, and that's me trying to fucking get past you, you crazy bitch. Get a to do to do to board and fill and toss it in the round one. Do do do. When mixed with pearl dust, makes good potion to breathing underwater. Wow. Is it a lock on the water instead of underwater? No, no, it's clear to spell. Potion tastes very bad. Wait, what? Walk on water? Hmm. Corpin is mixed with scales. That's a cheer to walk on water. Uh, Bunga's Bane left to the Clerk's Crow makes a good dispel potion. No bad effects with the Jira skill, but potion tastes very bad. <laughs> <laughs> Smells more dry and dusty. Tastes very moist. Good mushroom for eating, but too much makes the Jira clumsy. Jira use high fascia to make the Nixon meat more edible. The Jira could smell all the enchantments in the room. Jira found all the useful off in the room. <laughs> it just makes hound meat taste good. <laughs> I am lovely, madam. Until you block my doorway. And then you annoy me. Has Jack the Reaper found the Jira's stolen reports? Yes, here they are. Yes, these are the reports that Jira needs. Ajira thanks you, Jack the Ripper. Ajira is your friend always. Ajira worked very hard on these potions for you. Mm. Removed, removed, fire shield. Ooh, frost shield, lightning shield, spell absorption. Neato. Duty. 
Ajira knows many secrets, but they are not yet for a friend, Jack the Ripper. Speak with Ajira again when you are a warlock. Rani Sathri's here, may I'll do it for you. Okay. What? Hi. <laughs> Ice Witch! Hi, Ice Witch! How are you doing? Vince. Hi, Tata. Uh, Vince, man. I'm doing all right. Fucking, I got the stream and the audio and the game working again. So now you can hear me. You can see me. I can, you can hear the game. Things are going pretty nicely. And uh, do. The Mage's Guild appreciates the duties you've done, but sim you simply do not meet our requirements for journeymen. What? You have any duties? No. You don't have any duty for me. What about you? You got duty? Oh. <laughs> Ooh, say that word again. Duty? You talking about duty? Duty. <laughs> Step right up, Jack the Ripper, and look over my collection of scrolls. How about the flashy and cheap Taldem Scorcher to burn your foes? Or Undusi's unhinging to open struck chests and doors? If you're going somewhere with the dangerous, try some scrolls of vitality and vigor to restore your and health. Wait, what? Vigor to restore your and health and fatigue? I think <laughs> type. I think they meant to say your health and fatigue. Uh, if you're in real trouble, you'll want Almsivy intervention or divine intervention to transport you instantly to the nearest temple. Or oh, why is it? What? Crazy. Fucking. It says to go speak with Ajira, but. I don't, I can't, <sighs> okay, do you have any duties? No, let's just speak with Ajira, of course, but she says she doesn't want to, uh... what, Rannis Athris here may have duties for you, but there's not like Rannis, Rannis, who's Rannis, duty, Okay. Uh, Marion Drin, no. You're not who I'm looking for. You're not who I'm looking for. You're also who I'm not looking for. Wait, where is it? Can I get more information on this person, please? No. Uh -oh. What the heck? <laughs> hey, what up? Uh, can you help me advance? No? Okay, cool. That's great. Thanks. And I have to look for a fucking Rannis in here. Even though I, I don't think... Wait a minute. You are... What? But no, she doesn't. She doesn't have any freaking anything for me. I'm. Who? Heck yeah, man. I like this. This is my favorite chest. They always restock it. Fortify willpower. Fortify slot magica. Definitely use that. Special flora of Tamaria. Origin of the Mage's Guild. Ooh. I'm. I have gotten fat. Oh my shit. Uh, there it is. Boop. All right. Get that nice bolster of energy. So, what the hell do I do now? Uh, do you have any duty for me? Nope. Just speak with the Jira. But. What about you? 
Do you have any deity for me? No. But Azura doesn't have anything for me. <laughs> you want to make soup now, Tata? <laughs> we'll make some soup. What the hell? Pet look up in here. Right now, you don't need a bit of bit. Wait, ceramic bowl. Yes. Yes. Okay. What do you mean you don't have this stuff? Why don't you have the stuff to make soup? Uh, advancement. Damn it. What the hell? I just finished one of the tasks for her. What the hecky heck? Well, what do you need for your soup? I'm also a broke bitch. You know, you know what I'm on that. Oh, she don't. What the heck? This homework is thrown on the husband. She was like before finding her stolen reports. And reports of mushroom. Did you do I looked around and. What the heck? <coughs> mm. Well, now what? Hmm. Maybe I gotta do fucking tasks for other dudes in the Mages Guild? Maybe. Thank me, six hundred. the kind of thing. Give me a copy of the short history of Morrowind. Told me my attackers were like him. He suggests I speak with Apelles Matthias in Evanhart. Uh, sounds far. Spymaster sent me to the hands to the Belmore Fighters Guild. I'm never a secret cold. Oh, yeah, Fighters Guild. I need to do that. Well, what do you have? Uh, fuck. Just gonna do some drugs. Don't tell anyone. There's a guard right there. Okay. Go take this soldier. <laughs> Drugs good, vegetables bad. <laughs> what was I doing? Oh yeah, Fighters Guild. Man, this place is fucking tiny. Hello! Welcome to Banmore, a counter seat of House Hilary. Uh, Fighters Guild. Yes, this is, uh, I just fire eye. Hello, Wayne. Hey, you're who just who I need to speak to, I think. Well, speak up, Argonian. What do you want? Are you here to join the Fighters Guild? Yes. Yes, I am. You look like you could take care of yourself. Before I sign you up, you might want to look at the Fighters Guild Charter. Are you ready to sign up now? Read the Charter. Your duties are to your lords and brethren. In all ways, proceed with honor and valor. Keep a keen and watchful mind, and never succumb to the craven tricks of the weak. As a member, you are permitted to use items in your equipment chest. <coughs> it is traitorous to fight or thieve from another member of your guild. If you break these rules, you must speak with at least a warder of the guild to redeem your standing. Do you feel that you can uphold these simple ideals? Equipment chest. You bet! Totally! You are now a member of, uh, you are now Jack the Ripper, the associate, uh, in the Fighters Guild. Work hard, follow orders, and you'll do just fine. Seek me out if you feel you're ready for advancement. Okay. Equipment chest. You'll find basic supplies, arrows, bolts, healing potions. If you need more healing than that, head to the temple. We're all able to resupply the chest once in a while. 
but don't count on it, okay? <laughs> you turn on some noteworthy with some some question your depth of devotion. Perform more duties for the fighters to get on your, on your place. Okay. Wait. Uh, orders. I have a very simple contract to end an infestation of cave rats. You might be able to handle it. Okay. Cave rats. Go to Draren Thales' house. It's here in Belmora along the river on the east side. Ask her where the rats are coming from. Kill the rats and get your payment from Draren Thales. Report back to me once you've taken care of this. Okay. I can do that. I can kill a bunch of rats, no problem. Let me at them, let me at them after I get me some potions. Thank you. Appreciate the potions. Hell yeah, healing potion. <gasps> Armorer's hammer. Heck yeah, man. I'll repair my freaking armor and weapons. Uh, this way. Um, yeah. She said east side of the river, so we're gonna cross that bridge. Yeah. 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 I have gotten fat. Shit. Mm, yes. Some more drugs. Delicious. No, it's not drugs, it's alcohol. What is this? No. Drellus Athrin's house. Drain Thales. No, that's not it. No. Nope. Howdy. No. I think you're crazy. Now where, oh where is this person's house? Uh, no. Hmm. I need to find them rats. Drela Arethi? No, it's Drerain Thales. Drerain Thales. Nine toes. Nine toes? Hello. Fuck. Uh. I need to sell some of this stuff. I just have too much stuff on me. It's just too much. It's ridiculous. Uh, there's another thing you need to touch. No, I don't want to drop anything cool. Yum. Uh, fuck. I'm stuck here. I'm just probably dead. To reclaim myself alongside. I don't want to drop that because then people are going to take it. I don't like it when people take my stuff. Mm. I'm going to have to drop a lot of things. Blub, 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 blub. Blub, 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 blub. Drop all this. Uh, maybe I can drop this thing and then I'm going to move this stuff into a basket. Um, yes. And I'm gonna go and sell a bunch of things. Because I don't want any of this to go to waste. Item will not fit. Oh shit. Well, this is gonna be a little. <sighs> Fuck it, hell. Uh. No. I want to go all the way over there. Then I'll have to go and talk to people again. <sighs> Dang it. Why do I make things so difficult? Okay, 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 okay. 
Uh, yes. It's a good angle. Move that over there. Oh, I wish there was a faster way. Oh my gosh. Oh god. It's so slow. Oh wait. Yes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oi! Buy my stuff. What? Why? Why do I have to get rid of Moon Sugar? This is the Thieves Guild. What? At least move out of my way, lady. Come on. Jesus. Asshole. Oi! Buy my stuff. Yes! Buy my moon sugar. You don't buy that animal. Well, fuck you. I don't want this shit. Would you want to buy moon sugar? Oh. What about you? Oh. Well, who can I sell my fucking drugs to? I need somewhere to sell my drugs. What the heck? Uh, maybe I can just leave it in here. Boop. Nobody touch it. Nobody touch it. I'm looking at you, sugar lips. Alright. I don't trust her, but, you know. I have to. Actually, I'm going to keep that. You don't buy that item, why not? You buy books. Fucking damn it. Any intervention, you could come on disease. Divine, 45 personality. I kinda wanna keep that, actually. Fuck. Book of Dawn Dusk. Anticipations and love and effect 716. Good Mage's Guild. Mage's Guild, no. Damn it. Fucking. Will you buy something? Oh. Seems you... Ah, oh, you don't buy that one, but... Okay. I was about to say, you fucking crazy. Well, if none of you want to buy my shit, well, I'll take my business elsewhere. Fuck you guys. Fucking assholes. Move! Lady! Please! Thank you! Fuck you too, man. You bitch just called me disgusting. What an asshole. That was very nice. Hop, 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 Eddie. Hop, 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 Eddie. Hop. What? Fuck you, crate. Getting caught on everything. You want to buy my stuff? I have stuff if you want to buy. Uh, you can have this, you can have that, that, that. Um, You have a nice amount of gold. Let's see. I don't use that. Uh, four, five, four, two, two, two. I don't really need that. I like having that one. That one's a good hammer. That's a good hammer right there. That's a good weapon too. I don't want to get rid of that. Well, I guess I don't need the throwing stars. Uh, Claymore, longsword. I don't need that. Oh, yes. And... No. I don't want to sell these to you because... Fucking overselling. Alright. Let's add to this. And... Sell my shit. Yeah, money. A warm day to you as well, Walker. I am a businessman, pawnbroker. You don't believe we met, but I fucking met you the moment I came into town. 
Yeah, some people over here are just assholes. That shouldn't have put that right there. Yes. Offer. Thank you. I stole from this person. I wonder if they're going to attack me. Hello? Hello? Hi. You want some more Dark Brotherhood shit, dude? I got you, bro. Offer. Yeah. Give me that money. How much money do I got? Hey, 3,706. Hell yeah. I'm making that mm, fucking gold. Because we use the gold standard here. Um, I should probably read these. Where's the bookseller around here? I'm going to go read stories to the bookseller. I think they'll be very happy with that. Hello! Well, I'm, um, I, I shouldn't say welcome, actually. Oh, yes. I do care to talk. I am here to read you stories, bookseller, because I know how much you like books. So, the first one is Special Flora of Tamriel. Have you heard of that one yet, lady? I don't think you have. Maybe you have, I don't know. Special Flora of Tamriel by Hard in the Herbalist. The Poppy! And both black and white varieties may be found growing wild in the mountains of Hammerfell. Their succulent pods are often the only nourishment for adventurers who find themselves in the wilderness without rations. It is said that black and white poppies imbibed, imbibed with together have magical properties. When they are crushed and mixed with the milk of the agile-footed mountain goat, the resulting potions allow the user to glide safely above ground. Fire fern and perennial herb is native to the province of Morrowind. The flowers are inconspicuous and often hidden. The glossy evergreen foliage and blossoms are resistant to conditions of high heat and bright light. A petal from this plant placed under the adventurous tongue will provide protection from heat, the heat and fire of the lava pits and thermal streams around Dagoth Ur. Dragon's Tongue, the common name for a fern-like herb found in Black Marsh, is especially prolific around the area of the Ulthiris Swamp. It is a beautiful wildflower whose name comes from the fire-red far fronds that protect its golden efflorescence. As pretty as it is, however, it is a deadly poison to most living beings and needs to be avoided by adventurers. Especially unprotected ones that is lethal to the touch. Whoa. Crazy. It is said, however, that Argonians can handle the plant and use the sap derived from its roots to en enhance their endurance. Ooh. Neat. I can use it. Domica redwort is a herb grown by many residents of Valentwood for their beautiful and showy flowers. They attain a high of, of about three feet and sport feathery leaves. The flowers are usually bright red. In addition to their beauty, they are said to have had, said to have the magical ability of enhancing the appearance of anyone who carries or wears one of the blooms. What? What? Domica redwort apparently helps you look good. I don't believe it. Ironwood nut is a hard-shelled fruit that comes from the ironwood trees growing deep in the forest of Skyrim. The wood of these trees is hard as the metal after which it is named. The very rare black variety of ironwood is said to produce a nut which is very succulent and believed to greaten the strength of the adventurer who is able to crack its shell and partake of it. The ginkgo leaves, which are found along the banks of rivers and lakes of Hammerfell, are most inconspicuous. Only their peculiar half-moon shape making them noticeable. The edible foliage is very sweet and quite tasty. Legend has it that when mixed properly with the pulp of the aloe plant, the resulting concoction has the ability of increasing one's stamina for a short while. 
The Somnalius som fern can be found in the swamps of Black Marsh. The fronds of this plant are light green and quite delicate. Picking a frond can be very difficult, as they usually crumble to the touch, but once retrieved, it can be used to put an enemy to sleep for a short while by passing it under his nose. Arrowroot is a thick, rubbery tuber that can be found in the province of Valenwood. The plant is quite difficult to find as it is above ground foliage, is very meager and scrolly. But the root itself can be most beneficial to the gatherer as it has magical properties. The paste made from grinding the root is quite wholesome and can improve the user's accuracy with a bow and arrow or other missile weapon. Nightshade is reputed to be a very poisonous herb. However, the variety found in many parts of elsewhere is cherished by Khajiits, who have taken up cheers in thievery careers. Many Khajiits will tuck a piece of nightshade in, in, inside their armor to increase their ability to skulk, hide, and become invisible. Ooh, neat. Uh, what's this one? The Anuid paraphrased. The first ones were brothers, Anu and Padome. They became <laughs> Anakin and Padme. <laughs> they came into the void and time began. As Anu and Padme wandered the void, the interplay of light and darkness created Nur. Both Anu and Padme were amazed and delighted with her appearance. But she loved Anu, and Padme retreated from them in bitterness. Nair became pregnant, but before she gave birth, Padme returned, professing his love for Nair. What? She told him that she loved only Anu, and Padme beat her in rage. Anu returned, fought Padme, and cast him outside time. Nair gave birth to creation, but died from her injuries soon after. Anu, grieving, hid himself into the sun and slept. Meanwhile, life sprang up on the twelve worlds of creation and flourished. After many ages, Padme was able to return to time. He saw creation and hated it. He swung his sword, shattering the twelve worlds in their alignment. Anu awoke and fought Padme again. The long and furious battle ended with Anu the victor. He cast aside the body of his brother, who he believed was dead, and attempted to save creation by forming the remnants of the Twelve Worlds into one. Nern the world of Tamriel, uh, as he was doing so, Padme struck him through the chest with one last blow. Anu grappled with his brother and pulled them both outside of time forever. The blood of Padme became the Daedra. The blood of Anu became the stars. The mingled blood of both became the Aedra, hence their capacity for good and evil, and their greater affinity for earthly affairs than the Daedra, who have no connection to creation. On the world of Nern, all was chaos. The only survivors of the twelve worlds of creation were the Elnofe, and the Hist. The Elnofe are the ancestors of Myrrh and Men. The Hist are the trees of Argonia. Nur originally was all land with interspersed seas but no oceans. A large fragment of the Elnofe world landed on Nur relatively, Nern relatively intact, and the Elnofe living there were the ancestors of the Myrrh. These Elnofe fortified their borders from the chaos outside hid their pocket of calm, and attempted to live on as before. Other Elnafe arrived on Nern, scattered amid the confused jumble of the scattered worlds, wandering and finding each other over the years. Eventually, the wandering Elnafe found the hidden land of old Elnafe, and were amazed and joyful to find their kin living amid the splendor of ages past. The wandering Elnafe expected to be welcomed into the peaceful realm, but the old Elnafe looked on them as degenerates, fallen from their former glory. 
For whatever reason, war broke out and rage across the whole of Nern. The old Elnafe retained their ancient power and knowledge, but the wanderers were more numerous and toughened by their long struggle to survive on Nern. This war reshaped the face of Nern, taking much of the land beneath new oceans and leaving the lands as we know them. Tamriel, Akavir, Atamora, and Yokura. The old Elnafe realms although ruined, became Tamriel. The remnants of the Wanderers were left divided on the other three continents. <clears throat> other many years, the Elnafe of Tamriel became the Myr, Elf, the Dwemer, the Deep Ones, sometimes called Dwarves, the Chimer, the Changed Ones, who later became the Dunmer, the Dunmer, the Dark or Cursed Ones, the Dark Elves, the Bosmer, the Green or Forest Ones, the Wood Elves. The Altmer, the Elder or High Ones, the High Elves. On the other continents, the Wandering Elnafe became the Men, the Nords of Atmora, of Atmora, the Red Guards of Yokuda, and the Tsayeski of Akavir. The Hist were bystanders in the Elnafe War, but most of their realm was destroyed, as the war passed over it. A small corner of it survived to become Black Marsh in Tamriel, but most of their realm was sunk beneath the sea. Eventually, men returned to Tamriel. The Nords were the first, colonizing the northern coast of Tamriel before recorded history, led by the legendary Hesgrimor. The thirteenth of his line, King Harold, was the first to appear in written history, and so the mythic era ended. Ooh. That's crazy. Is that what I was reading? Yeah. The Anticipations. The Daedra are powerful ancestors, spirits similar in form and, and substance to the Tribunal. Blessed be their holy names. But weaker in power and more arbitrary, and removed from the affairs of mortals. In old times, the Chimer worshipped the Daedra as gods, but they did not deserve this ven veneration, for the Daedra harmed their worshippers as often as helped them. The advent of the Tribunal, blessed be their holy names, changed this unhappy state. By the apotheosis, apotheosis the Tribunal, blessed be their holy names, became their protectors and high ancestor spirits of the Dunmer and bade the Daedra to give proper veneration and obedience. The three good Daedra, Boethia, Azura, and Mafala, recognized the divinity of the Triune Ancestors. Blessed be their holy names. The rebel Daedra, Molek Bol, Malakath, Shiagorath, my favorite, and Meruz Dagon, refused to swear fealty to the tribunal, blessed be their holy names, and their worshippers were cast out. These rebel Daedra thus became the four corners of the house, of troubles, and they continue to plague our tranquility and tempt the unwary into heresy and dark worship. The priests of the temple remain ever vigilant for signs of the adversary's return, sometimes aided by the loyal three good Daedra, who are familiar with the wiles of their rebellious kin. The good Daedra are known to the temples as the Anticipations since they are the, clear, the early ancestral anticipations of the loving patronage of the tribunal. The anticipations are the Daedra, Lord Boethia, Mephala, and Azura. Boethia is the anticipation of Almanlexia, but male to her female. Boethia was the ancestor who illuminated the elves ages ago, before the mythic era. He told them the truth of Lorcan's test, and defeated Oriel's champion, Trinimac. Boethia ate Trinimac and avoided him. The followers of Boethia, ew. Gross. The followers of Boethia and Trinimac rubbed the soil of Trinimac upon themselves and changed their skins. Ew. Mephala is the anticipation of Vivek, but manifolds and androgynous. Mephala taught the Chimer to evade their enemies or kill them with secret murder. The Chimer were few in those days and threatened on all sides. Mephala taught the Chimer to build houses. Later, Mephala created the Morai Tongue. 
Azura is the anticipation of Sotha's seal, but female through his male. Azura was the ancestor who taught the Kaimer how to be different from the Altmer. Her teachings are sometimes attributed to Boethia. In the stories, Azura is often encountered more as a communal progenitor of the races as a whole rather than as an individual ancestor. She is associated with dusk and dawn, and is sometimes called the Mother's Soul. Azura's star, also called the Twilight Star, appears briefly at dawn and dusk, low on the horizons below the constellation of the Steed. Azura is associated with mystery and magic, fate and prophecy. Yeah. I don't know if I read this one. Uh, yes, I read this one. Origin of the Mages Guild. Okay. I don't think I read this either. Origins of the Mages Guild by the Archmage Salarth. The idea of a collection of mages, sorcerers, and assorted mythics, mystics pooling their resources and talents for the purpose of research and public charity was a revolutionary concept in the early years of the Second Era. The only organization then closest in, uh, in aim and structured to what we know today as the Mages Guild was the Sigic Order of the Isles of Arteum. At the time, magic was something to be learned by individuals, or at most within intimate covens. Mages were not actually hermits, usually quite solitary. The Sigic Order served the rulers or Somerset Isle as counselors, and chose its members through a complex ritualized method not understood by outsiders. Its purpose and goals likewise went unpublished and detractors attributed the worst evils as the source of the Order's power. Actually, the religion of the Old Order could be described as ancestor worship, an increasingly unfashionable philosophy in the Second Era. When Valus Galerian, a Sigic of Octaeum and student of the famed Iachesis, began collecting magic users from around Somerset Isle. He attracted the animosity of all. He was operating out of the urban center, first told, and there was a common, and not entirely unfounded, attitude that magical experiments should be conducted only in unpopulated areas. Even more shocking, Galarian proposed to make magical items, potions and even spells, available to any member of the general public. Who could afford to pay. No longer was magic to be limited either to the aristocracy of intelligentsia. Galerian was brought before Iachesis and the king of first hold, Rilis the something. Seventh? I don't know. No. No. No, 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 no. Twelfth. Twelfth? I don't know. And I'm not good with Roman numerals. And made to state the intentions of the fraternity he was forming. The fact that Galerian's speech to Rilis and Iachesis was not recorded for posterity, it doubtless uh, is doubtless a tragedy, though it does afford opportunity for historians to amuse one another with speculation about the lives and persuasions Galerian might have used to found the ubiquitous organization. The character, at any rate, was approved, the Charter. Almost immediately after the guild was formed, the question of security had to be addressed. The Isle of Arteum did not require a force of arms to shield it from invaders. When the Sigic Order does not wish someone to land on the Isle, it and all its inhabitants simply become insubstantial. The new Mages Guild, by contrast, had to hire guards, Galerian soon discovered that the Tamrielian nobility has known for thousands of years. Money alone does not buy loyalty. The knightly order of the lamp was formed the following year. Like a tree from an acorn, the Mages Guild grew branches all over Somerset Isle, and gradually the mainland of Tamriel. 
There are numerous records of superstitious or for sensibly fearful rulers forbidding the guild in their dominance, but their heirs or heirs' heirs eventually recognize the wisdom of allowing the guild free reign. The Mages Guild has become a powerful force in Tamriel, a dangerous foe if a somewhat disinterested ally. There have only been a few rare incidents of the Mages Guild actually becoming involved in local political struggles. On these occasions, the Guild's participation has been the ultimate decider in the conflict. <coughs> I need to drink some water. Throat's getting all dry. As begun by Vanus Galarian, the Mages Guild as an institution is presided over by a Supreme Council of six Arch Magisters. Each guild hall is run by a Guildmaster. Guild Magister. Assisted by a twofold council, the, mag the Master of Incunabula, Incunabula, that's a weird word, and the Master of At Arms. The Master of Incunabula resides over an additional council of two mages, the Master of Academia and the Master of the Scree? Scry. Scry? Scree. Scry. So I'm going to say Scry. The Master at Arms also has a council of two. The Master of Initiates and the Palatinus, the leader of the local chapter of the Order of the Lamp. The leader of the local chapter of the Order of the Lamp? What the hell is the Order of the Lamp? One need not be a member of the Mages Guild to know that this carefully contrived hierarchy is often nothing more than a chimera. As Vanus Galarian himself said bitterly, leaving Tamriel to travel to other lands. The guild has become nothing more than an intricate morass of political infighting. Well. <clears throat> I'll read that some other time. Ancestors of the Dunmer. For fire. Yeah. Okay. So now I can sell all of these. And then I just fucking fix this right here. And move you just a wee bit right there. Okay. There we go. Okay. Uh, ancestors of the Dunmer. I'm gonna keep that one. All right. Uh, hmm. Okay. Let's sell all this and go get the other stuff to sell that I put down. Um, where am I? What is this? Armor writer. Yeah. Oi. You want some freaking. You want a ring, dude? I got you a fucking ring. Oh, you don't like rings. He has a lot of fucking money. Hmm. That on store health, store magic bill. Okay, I am over in comfort. Great, I have got it back. Standard restore health, standard restore magic bill. We'll put that over there. And then we're gonna sell. And where was the alchemist? I think the alchemist is over here. Over that way. 
Oh, thanks, man. I don't even know you. Who the hell are you? Thanks, man. Look at this dude. Fucking walking all like he's... Like he's... He, like he runs this place. Silly ass. So health, so of you. Damn, you have a lot of fucking gold, dude. This bitch got some money. be left alone. I need you to get off my back. Thank you. Let me get my shit. Okay, what was I doing? Oh yeah. I need to find this person. Uh, Drarain Thalus. Near the river. on the east side of the river, but... Hmm... This is a tower. So where the heck is this person's house? It said by the river. Nine toes. I already checked there. Drain Thales. Dreaming Thalus, Dreaming Thalus, need to find the house of Dreaming Thalus. What is this? Dreaming Thalus storage. So this must be the place. Yes. Okay. Hello. Why are you floating? Are you the one they sent to take care of the cave rats? These rats are such a nuisance. I'm worried they'll eat all of my pillows. You like pillows, don't you, Jack the Ripper? Anyway. I got one trapped in my bedroom here. The other two are in my storage area upstairs. Rats, that is. Not pillows. Here's the key to that door. There are at least three of these beasts. I hope they haven't gotten into my good pillows. Okay. No. I mean, you can move. 
Die, rat. Die. Die. Fucking die, dude. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a good thing I got restore health. Standard, standard restore fatigue. Boop. Hmm. Ooh. Don't mind me. Just gonna get me an extra award. I do. Okay. Well, your room is clear. You should probably clean it. Die. Die. You're not dying. Oi! Oi, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Holy crap. Why do you hurt so much? Fucking die, dude. Fucking die, jump technique. Jump technique. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh. I'm gonna blame it on the rats. The rats ate her gold. Damn, she has a lot of pillows. That's a lot of pillows. She must sell pillows. Either that or she's crazy, judging by her bed that has a bunch of pillows on it. Alright. Well now, Jack the Ripper, you're back again. And what can I do for you this time? Can I interest an outlander like you for a little, little, little more? No. Nope. I don't even know that. Noisy. Quit talking in tandem, you weirdos. Hello, I've completed contract. What? There's one rat trapped in the bedroom, and there are two others in the storage. He is giving me the key, and I should find and kill all the rats and then return her one. But I did! Maybe I didn't use the right speech bubble? Thank you. Now the cave rats. I'll take your word that the cave rats are dead. Here, take these hundred septums. It's what I agreed to pay the fighters guild. Ooh. Okay. Thank you. Money. A money. Hello. Don't mind me. I am just being a wizard. Uh, you are here for orders of events, mental associate. 
Advancement. The Fighters Guild recognizes you, Jack the Ripper. You are now Jack the Ripper the Apprentice. Orders. I have a very simple contract to end an infestation of cave rats. You might be able to handle it. Okay. So, you killed the rest, Jack the Ripper. Not bad for you. You ready for more orders? Yes, please. A local egg mine has problems with egg poachers, and you're going to solve those problems. Yes, egg poachers. May sound silly, but those quama eggs are among the few things worth exporting from this nasty little province. Drum Barrow, the owner of Shulk Eggs Mines, wants to make an example of these thieves to keep other miners from getting any funny ideas. The egg poachers, Sir Villa Waltham and Daniela Vano Vallis, are former egg miners, a very long, local, long time local troublemakers. You can handle that, can't you? Report back when the poachers are dead. Oh, I already did that, apparently. <laughs> egg poachers, you got both of them? Good. Here's your payment, a hundred septums. And we've got some extra potions from a recent raid. Take these, they'll come in handy. Uh, just tell me when you're ready for more orders. Uh, advancement. The Fire's Guild recognizes you, Jack the Ripper. You are now Jack the Ripper the Journeyman. All right, orders. We have a contract from the Caldera Mining Company to kill four Telvani agents responsible for trouble at the Caldera Mine. Four Telvani agents are responsible for thieves and disappearances and at the Caldera Ebony Mines. Their names are Alinu Arelian, Arelian, Alinu Arelian, Safasa Norothran, Fothia, Fothna Herothran, and Alveleg. Alveleg. They're hiding in the cave in the hills north of Caldera Mine. When the four agents are dead, report back to me. Take care, it is very likely that one of them is a lookout post outside the mines. The quickest way to Caldera is probably to have the guild. Uh, guide at the Mage's Guild transport you, but it is your choice. Uh, the Caldera Mining Company says they've been learn learned a group of Tilvani agents are spying on the Caldera Mine Works. There have been a number of ebony thefts, uh, missing guards, escaped slaves, and these Tilvani agents are responsible. She's been expelled from the Fighters Guild. She stole from her guild steward. She's stupid, but she can fight. She joined the Thieves Guild when we kicked her out. But she's nothing important. This Caldera Mine trouble is not a Thieves Guild job. Uh, she's Thieves Guild, a local dark elf, nowhere important. And this Caldera Mine trouble has nothing to do with the Thieves Guild. I didn't want that. I didn't want to choose this one. Thank you. She's Thieves Guild, a local Darth Elf. She's been known on the Zero's Coast. She could be trouble, but like I told you, this is coming. Not a Thieves Guild job. Okay. Alvaleg. He's Thieves Guild, a Wood Elf. The Talvani prefer to hire Nords and Wood Elves when they can't get natives. I know nothing about him, but this is not a Thieves Guild job, so he has no protection. Okay, so I wonder. I wonder what happens if I were to speak to someone about this in the Thieves Guild. Is this where I came from? No. Yes. I wonder if I can do that. Report to them about a Fighters Guild job. Hello! Uh, Fighters Guild. Nothing. 
that it means that I have a free pass to kill them and nobody will give a damn. So I'm going to find and kill four Tavani agents responsible for those disappearance at the Caldera mine. Their names are Alinu, Arlen, Sathasa, Northwind, Fuzzin, Harathran, and Eldeleg. They're hiding in a cave in the hills north of Caldera mine and I probably will And nah. What else did I need to do around here? I don't think I need to do much. Wait. No sniffling. I don't want to catch the coronavirus. Alright, so I'm going to go in here, go all the way down, and uh then I'm going to get off. The stream is going to be ending soon. Thank you so much for joining and watching. I hope you enjoyed for some reason. And uh, I'll continue this either later on tonight or tomorrow super early in the morning. I don't know. Whichever one I'm awake for. <laughs> anyway, that's the end of the stream. Later. <laughs>